Hey guys, what's up? Squan17 here. Welcome to a Sum Game Sunday. Today, what I've got for you guys is the M4A1S Cyrex giveaway winner, some CSGO footage, and a TF2 soldier commentary. So, congrats to Isaiah Espinoza on winning. Um, I will send this skin over pretty soon, just as soon as you get back to me and send me your trade link. Um, to everyone else, there will be more giveaways in the near future, I promise. I really like doing these. I talked about it uh, last video a little bit. I do enjoy doing giveaways. Um, I like giving back to you guys because it's fun and you guys enjoy it. There's incentive to participate on my videos and stuff like that. So there will be more in the near future, I promise. Um, if you do want to unsubscribe, you know, I do get it. Um, I understand maybe you just came here to mooch off me and get my money. And, you know, I honestly get that. I used to do it all the time. But I'd really appreciate it if you stuck around, you know, check out some of my other stuff, and I do promise there will be more giveaways in the future. So, anyways, how I do today is pretty good. Um, the CSGO clips are leftovers from last week's video. Um, I just wasn't able to get all of them in. I had more than I needed, so I used those today. I don't have any Fallout for you guys. Um, unfortunately, I was going to do a little bit of a guide on um, getting the... I forget what it is. It's like a handheld cannon, pretty much. You might know what I'm... The Broadsider. I was going to do a guide on getting the Broadsider. I already have the footage, but it's just a lot to edit, and I really don't have time today, so I'll save that for next Fallout video that I do. And um, I decided to make up for it with more TF2 than usual. Honestly, TF2 has been a pretty small part of my uh, videos lately and Fallout's been the big thing and I know a lot of you guys still do like TF2 and so I have more of that for you guys today so I hope you will enjoy that um, the CSGO is all gonna be 3Ks I think and then the TF2 is just three games of Soldier and the highlights of that I think I went 47 and 9 overall um, if I remember correctly but this is mainly just gonna be a little highlights um, I didn't really have a lot of time to do this. Uh, today is Sunday the 24th. I just uploaded like 10 hours ago uh, my most recent video other than this one, which was my uh, R6 and CSGO commentary. And I had work today. I have a ton of homework actually while I was recording that TF2. I was on Skype with my friend Royal Sapphire who was in last video. And we were just studying. I have this gigantic exam tomorrow. It's crazy. It's on six different lectures. It's about the Cold War. There are a ton of dates. It's like two essays, a map, and like five IDs. It's a lot. And I'm pretty stressed out, so that's why I couldn't edit more. That's why I couldn't get the Fallout in today. It's just because I really had to focus on that, but I did get the video like I said I would really try to do last video. And here it is. So, uh, my opinions on CSGO. Um, you know, it's alright. I'm getting kind of bad due to my lack of playing lately. Like, that little clip you guys saw at the very beginning, um, with the M4A1 Cyrex that I had. I just want to get a little footage with it so you guys could see what it looks like in-game. Um, I hadn't played CSGO in a while, and it took me a bit to get the little 5k there in Deathmatch. Like, even in Deathmatch, I'm bad. Like, I'm trying to look around and aim at people, and I'm just totally overshooting. I think I even have my sensitivity lower on R6 than I do on CSGO, and that's something I want to talk about, actually. I'm really curious about it. Do you guys know of, like, a scale so you can set your, um, R6 sensitivity to the same sensitivity as your CSGO? Because they go on different measurements, if that makes sense. Like, CSGO is all kind of down in the first 10 digits, so, like, 1 through 10, generally, to my understanding, whereas, uh, R6, I think, goes through 50 or higher, maybe even 100, so they're really unmatched. And I just kind of guessed to have R6 around the same sensitivity. So if you know a way to get it exactly the same, that would be great. Please do let me know. But I didn't do so well. So CSGO just isn't that fun for me lately, but hopefully it will be better later. TF2 was actually a bit more fun than usual today, especially because I did well, at least in my opinion. Um, I know going 49 or 47 and 9 isn't really all that great. But for me, given the fact that I really just haven't played TF2 at all lately, that's pretty good. And I had a lot of fun recording it, actually, because I was just kind of studying and messing around at the same time. And it made it a little bit more interesting. So it was a positive experience for once. Generally, my TF2 experiences lately haven't been that great. But I think I might get back into the game more now that I'm not playing as much CSGO. So, anyways, um, next week's plans, as I see it right now, um, more CSGO, probably because I'm going to be at my dad's house, and that's pretty much the only game that works on the computer I have there. I'm able to run it decently well so that I can actually play at a competitive level, um, if you know what I mean. Like, I don't mean professional, I just mean like I can play comp matches and not have bad FPS and have that screw me over most of the time. So I'll try and do some more, um, I'll try and do a comp a day if I can, and just take the highlights from those like I did for this video, which is from uh, two weeks ago now. 
I'll try and do that if I can, and then also I think I'm gonna try and do some ARC footage because at the beginning of this week or last week for you guys, <laughs> this is also confusing, um, at the beginning, I, I don't even know, I'm not gonna try and explain it, on Martin, 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 yes, Martin Luther King, no, Martin Luther King Day, um, here in the US, we celebrate it, we get the day off, I don't know if in other parts of the world you guys do that, um, I'm guessing not, just because he's an American dude, but we do that here, sorry to be an ignorant American and not know, but we do it here, and I had the day off, and I did some Martin Luther King thingies, but I also had, uh, some free time, and so I decided to play a ton of ARC with my friends, and I just got a lot of funny moments of that, so hopefully I'll try and do that as well as in my next video, and I'm really stuttering right now, I'm super, super distracted, like, I'm really stressing about this test, like, Grades are just so important right now, you know? Like, it, it really matters. Like, this is my junior year. If I want to get into colleges, you know, I really have to try. I really have to go hard. And that's just kind of difficult for me because I do have a lot going on. Some people don't really know that, but YouTube does take a lot of time for me. I really do enjoy it, though. It's worth it to me. But at the same time, I really have to be focusing on school. You know, I want to stay in shape as well, so I have to focus on working out. I have a lot of homework, you know. It's just a bunch of stuff, so I am really stressed right now. But I'm happy to make this commentary. Um, it gives me a little break from studying. But I hope you can forgive me if I uh, sound a little bit distracted today. Anyways, just a few more things I'd like to talk about. We have about three minutes left in this video. Um, here are some plans I have in the future, and this should be really good. Like, I really think you guys would like this. I would certainly enjoy it if I weren't me. Um, I really want to do a Fallout 4 series with my mom. Now, I know that sounds kind of kind of crazy. Um, I did that CSGO one with my mom one time, and, you know, the playing didn't go great, but the video was really well received. I mean, there were five butthurt people who disliked it because they wish they were as good as my mom, but um, otherwise, it went really well. That's my second most popular video I have. Um, which is really nice, so I was thinking, you know, why not expand to some more games, and I looked it up, and I saw that not really many people have done, uh, Fallout 4 with their moms, in fact, I don't know if any have, so, I'd really like to do that, I think it'd be really fun, she's up for it, she enjoys, um, participating in my videos, supporting me, which I really like, I really appreciate it, so that's something I definitely want to do in the near future, if you're interested, let me know, I was kind of thinking of almost making a separate channel, just for me and my mom, maybe. Like, on there, I'd upload all the raw footage, and then on here, I'd upload the highlights, kind of like I did um, with that CSGO video I did with her. Like, that was not all the footage. We played for maybe 45 minutes, and that was like a 10-minute video, I want to say, or something like that. I don't know exactly, but it wasn't everything, so I was thinking maybe we'd do that, or even better, maybe live stream it, and then take all the highlights, edit it, and put it here on this channel. I don't know, though. Just let me know what you'd be interested in seeing, because I definitely don't plan on uploading. Like, it would take probably my mom and I, I would say since she's pretty new to video games, like 50 or 60 hours um, to beat Fallout, and that would be a lot of episodes, so I don't know how I'll do it, but let me know what you're interested in, if you want to see that, or even if you don't, let me know, I'm probably still going to try and do it because I think it's a good idea, but if you have some major objection, please do let me know. Um, another thing I want to talk about that I mentioned last video, in fact, I made it the title of my last video was a uh, new intro, um, I am going to do one, and I was talking about doing two different intros last video, but I think I'm going to stick with one uh, for now. I am actually working on it. I figured out how to download um, fonts into my uh, Windows Movie Maker Live editor, so I didn't realize I could do that, but I can have pretty much any font that I like. So that kind of takes pair, pair, takes pair of my problems. That takes care of my um, on-screen text problems that I kind of anticipated with making the intro, so it actually should be possible to do on this editor. Also, my cousin offered to get me uh, Sony Vegas or one of the really good editors as a late Christmas present, which would be awesome. Um, I would definitely like that, so maybe I'll be able to uh, edit that on there. But I am working on it, actually. It's something I'm really interested in doing right now, is making that intro for you guys, just because I haven't had one in a while. And yeah, so that's pretty much the end of this video. Um, thanks, you all. Thanks, you all. Jesus, this is really bad. Like, you see, this is what happens. Like, I'm distracted. I'm really tired, you know, like, I'm, I'm really stressing out, like, I've mentioned it, like, four or five times now, but, like, it, it screws me over, like, it makes me really bad at doing other things, so do forgive me, um, what I'm hoping is once this kind of section 
of school is over, like once I'm done with the middle of junior year, it should get a little bit easier, or at least a little more drawn out. Right now, we just have really short um, periods of school, so they cram a lot in, and that's why I'm so stressed out. So hopefully, um, that will be over soon, and I can get back into YouTube more and get you guys better videos. But do forgive me. Uh, anyways, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Follow me on Twitter, at Quan Games. Like the Facebook page, Quan Games. Join the Steam group, Quan Clan. And thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next week.